Hi, in this video, we're going to be comparing these two USB hubs. So this is the 10 DAC USB 3.0 hub. This one is very, very fancy. It's got four ports here and looks like it has another port here. And you can turn the ports on and off and I'll show you how to do that in a minute. Also, this one can be powered with electricity. So you can actually plug it into an outlet or you can plug it into something via a USB. Whereas here we have the Vention Hub. This one has three ports here, one port here, and it has some other port here which I've never really used so I can't really comment on. It's also a lot smaller and it doesn't have the ability to be plugged into a power outlet. So I used to use this one all the time when I was making uh, specific types of videos, but I ended up switching and I'm now currently using this one because it's much smaller and it's space saving. So if you're looking for you know, something that has more features like this one where you can turn them on and off, or if you're looking for the ability to have that external power, then you're gonna wanna go with this one. I was doing something where I needed the external power in my video making process, so I was forced to use this one. I no longer am making those types of videos, so now I'm just using this one on a daily basis. This is the Vention, both are great products. Let me just go ahead and plug both of these in so you see exactly how they work. Let's start with the 10 DAC. Let's go ahead and plug it in via a USB into my laptop. Look what happens when I plug it in. Everything lights up. So you see these buttons, if I press this button, it's supposed to disable the USB, but look what happens. It doesn't actually disable it. So in order to disable it, what you have to do is you have to take a device, I'm gonna take my phone, and I'm gonna plug it into this. Phone's being charged right now, it just beeped, but now I can press it, and now it's no longer being charged. Let me press it again, it's being charged. So it has that ability to toggle on and off but it will only work when you actually plug in a device to it, which I think is kind of strange. Okay, let's perform the same test, but this time I'm gonna plug it into a power outlet. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in right now. My phone is being charged. If I press it, didn't turn off, let's do it again. My phone is not being charged. Press it, phone is being charged. Now let's take a look at the Vention. This is the one I use on a daily basis, mainly because it's smaller and I no longer need that external power source to charge my USB devices. So this seems to work really well. So all you do is you plug it in here, and then you're good to go. The light turns on, and then you can plug in devices into it. I'm gonna go ahead and plug in my phone. It's charging, unplug it, it's no longer charging. So it doesn't have the capability to turn it on or off. It also doesn't have that external power. So if you do need that external power, you're definitely gonna to wanna to go with the 10 DAC. If you're looking for something more space saving, like I'm currently using, you're gonna to wanna to go with the Vention. There's a couple other things you should know. So I bought the 10 DAC sometime last year. It's been over six months and I used it for a few months and then I stopped using it because I no longer needed that external power source. So I used it, but not for that long, maybe just a few months. Whereas the Vention, I did use it pretty much the whole time. Even when I was using the 10 DAC, I was still using the Vention. And I've, I've had this for over a year and I use it on a daily basis. So this is a really, really tough product. I'm not saying this isn't a tough product, but I am saying that I only use this for a few months and it's worked great, no problems, but my use has been limited to a few months, maybe three or four months. Whereas this one, I've used it for over a year. I do think they're both great and I suspect that this one will last a long time. It feels fairly well made. So which one you buy is going to depend on your needs. Again, if you need that external power source, if you're trying to charge a lot of things, this is a good choice, especially because you don't have to plug it into your computer to charge. You can put this next to your bed and plug it into the outlet in your wall and you can charge multiple phones or multiple devices. So it's very, very convenient and a very, very powerful device. Whereas this is something you're probably just gonna wanna use with your computer and it's more space saving. So that's the only reason I don't use this one is because I have this one and it's more space saving. So it's a tough choice. You'll have to make up your mind about which one you want. I am happy I bought both because you never know when you need either, right? Someday I might start using this again. And for now, I'll keep using the Vention. They're both great and I like them both. Hopefully after watching this video, you can make a better decision about which one is right for you. Good luck.